For this demo, we will be showing you inventory management. It can be integrated into your existing inventory management systems. As I log in, I'm being authenticated against the existing user database. As you see, inventory management has some basic modules such as receiving, transfers, mark out of stock or adjustments, price lookup, inventory counts, and the ability to view and edit records. Additional modules such as price change and in-store counts can also be added. Let's begin with receiving. To do, we can do receiving by carton or by detail. A receiving by detail requires an, an order number. This can be adjusted or configured to be any other sort of identifier for your receiving documents, such as an ASN number or just a simple transaction number. Then we can go ahead and scan items. Upon each scan, the items are added to my document. I can also do an item lookup with a description or style number or do a manual entry of a UPC or SKU. Once I've completed my, trans my receiving, I can click the Done button. Let's go back and create a transfer. We have transfers out and transfers in, which can be done by carton or by detail. Transfers out can be done that by corporate initiated transfers or store initiated transfers. For a store initiated transfer, the authorization number or any other sort of transaction number can be uh, created by the device. We then select our store location, our reason for my transfer out, and then we begin my cart our carton. A cart number is automatically generated by the handheld. Go ahead and scan items. As they are added, our carton is being built. To move on to our next carton, simply click the next the new carton button. That will then create a cart with a additional carton number. Go ahead, scan some more items. And we can click the done button. <clears throat> we also have the the option of adding a manager approval code to make sure that all transfers out are approved by management. Once we click save, we see that we now have two records on the handheld. We can also conduct a price lookup. Price lookup will pull up prices that are in your current POS system. And there you go, you see our current price, original price, and sale price. Going back to the main menu, we can also conduct inventory lookups, or sorry, inventory counts, or mark out of stock transactions. For more information, please view our detailed video demos on inventory management.